Welcome to my second video, everybody. Today, we're going to be talking about the new pre-fall 2013 black and white collection. Um, it was kind of a no-brainer for me. I just don't know why it took me so long to figure this one out. But I am a huge fan of black and white prints, black and white combos, anything I wear. A lot of black and white together, especially recently, if you check out my blog. But it crossed my mind that I should probably do um, some type of black and white collection. So then pre-fall was coming up, so there was no better timing. So I came up with the pre-fall collection. It's just a small collection of five bags, um, and they're all black and white. So I'm in love with them. They're really, really easy to wear, so let's get started. Here we've got the pom-pom clutch. Love, love, love this. I couldn't even tell you how I came up with the idea for this. Like, I literally, like, found this upholstery fabric here. Love the print. I've seen it before, but I had no idea of how I wanted to use it just yet. So I finally picked this up, and I broke it up a little bit with a leather strip going down the center. And I remember seeing these pom-poms in the store, and I was like, I need to use this on a bag somehow, some way. So... No better time than to use it for this bag. I used um, also white piping to outline the black leather strip down the center. Love that little touch. But black two-sided zipper, leather pull tabs, simple black lining on the inside. Simple, simple. Love the pom-pom clutch. So that's one from that collection. What do we think about this one? I love it. I've had this one in mind for a really, really, really long time. I was just waiting for the perfect time to, like, I guess, make it available for everyone. Uh, I really wanted to do, like, a solid black leather clutch and black fringe on the top and bottom, except for the center row is white fringe. Leather super soft, perfect size, and then I lined it with this adorable black and white print on the inside. Love. I call this one hang time. Hang time clutch. This one. Love this one as well. Call this the half and half clutch. That way, if you don't want to show off all of your goodies in your bag, you got this at the bottom that will hide whatever you got in your bag. If you can look up close and see that, not sure if you can see it. But it's actually like a polyester black netting, and then I backed it with a white fabric, so you can actually see white through the black netting, and then it's transparent on the top. Pretty perfect. Half and half clutch. I kind of thought of like cup half full kind of thing. It was a little weird, but that's how I came up with the half and half name. So it's got the leather pull tabs on the top. Pretty simple. Going along with that transparent trend. And the next clutch is going to be. Um, Checkmate clutch. My sister actually gave me the idea for this bag. It actually reminded me of a checkerboard. So, checkmate it was. Pretty simple. Um, solid, just black and white checker print. Fold over. And then it's got the double slider zipper again. Black zipper with the black lining on the inside. Pretty simple. It looks so great with black and white. Or even a color. So, it really great with like a solid color. Um, and then my ultimate favorite from the black and white collection, it's super, super easy to wear, and I find myself wearing it a lot, is the Too Faced clutch. Black leather on one side, white leather on the other side. So you can wear it on either side, depending on whatever you're wearing, you can switch it up. Um, black zipper with silver metal teeth, and then I put this print on the inside, break it up a little bit. So it's got the black leather with white stitching down the center. And then it switches over with the white leather and black stitching on the other side. Super easy to wear. Wear it all the time. But that's pretty much it for the black and white collection. So if you have any other questions or other things that you really want to get to know about Love Courtney or things you want to hear next, see on YouTube. Just let me know. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.